is up YouTube man coming out with another banger video and today's topic we're going to be talking about your corrupted mindset is what's getting you stuck in life now there's a reason why you clicked on this video because this is a situation that you're dealing with right now this is a problem that you're dealing with right now I'm here to tell you guys that your mindset is everything bro Everything that falls behind, like discipline, motivation, who you want to become, your goals, everything has to do with the mindset, though. If you don't have this straight, bro, everything is just going to fall. If you do have it straight, everything is going to increase and become better for you. Your mindset is, is a thinking or a knowing or who you are based on what you're going to do every day your habits, you know, your environment, the person that who you just really are mentally. Your mindset plays a big role of the type of person you are. Example, if your mindset is on smoking weed, drinking alcohol, trying to get turned up all the time, well, guess what? That's what you're going to fucking do. Ain't nobody can tell you otherwise. Ain't nobody can't get you out of it, bro. It's just the mindset that you develop with yourself. If you that type of guy that want to just chase not, not good women all the time, bro, then that's what you're going to do. You're just going to be a sip man, beta male, Johnny motherfucker, bro. You're going to be chasing women that is no good for you, that got nothing to do with you because they already know you got a low self-esteem. They know that you're weak-minded. If you that type of guy that don't want to elevate in your life, you don't have no type of ambition, you, you don't have no type of goals for yourself, you don't want to look at the future, then guess what, bro? You always going to be fucking behind. Everything comes with a punishment and everything comes with a reward. But based on your mindset, bro, it's either or. Who you going to be? Is that the mindset that you want to have? Or do you want to have a abundance mindset and go out here and make something happen for yourself every day? You want to be great in life. You want to be ambition. You want to have goals. You want to have a great future. Because when your mindset is stuck on something that is not good for you, then it's always going to be bad for you. You go always have a low life. You go always be depressed. You go always be in situations that you don't want to be in. A lot of you guys, it, it takes you a lot of time. It takes you guys over and over and over and over again to something really bad. Happen. And then that's when you want to change. Some of you guys, it's just for your whole life. You just don't give a fuck. Because your mindset is just, I don't care what happens. I don't care. I'm, I'm here to just please myself and never get in. Then wonder why you never get nowhere in life. And then get mad at somebody else that has a strong mind, has a bitch in mindset. And get jealous and hate on him, hate on him and try to make his life worse. Because your mindset weak. You want to be in his shoes. You think he lucky. Nah, he ain't lucky. It's because the mindset. His mindset helped him build the discipline. His mindset helped him think about the goals that he want to be. Who he want to achieve to. His mindset is what helping him guide, guide him into the man he is now. But you want to get jealous because your mindset is to smoke weed all the time, drink alcohol. Don't want to do nothing with your life versus another man that has a strong mindset that actually goes to the gym, that actually is different as the eye went out. You can't get mad at that because like I said in my recent video, bro, life is about choices and whatever you want to choose as your mindset, that's who you're going to end up as. There's nobody to blame. There's nobody. It's nobody's fault but yours. Accept the fucking truth. Some of you guys, like I said, you stubborn, you're selfish. You don't, you don't want to believe that it's you. It's fucking you, bro. I'm going to let you right now. I'm going to let you know right now it's you. Period. But if you have a mindset to come out here and just like, bro, I'm going to just, you know, I'm going to go all in, bro. 
for I'm gonna do this for like a whole year. I'm gonna go to the gym for a whole year, get my cardio in, lifting weights, getting stronger, eating healthier. I'm gonna find more ways to make more money. I'm gonna do Uber on the side while I'm working this full time job, or I'm gonna just pick up another job and then I'm gonna start a side business. Or I'm going to just work on, you know, reading books so I become more knowledgeable. I can become wiser. I can learn more vocabulary and words. You know, like anything that your mind is on for self-improvement. Then your life just be starting to become better over time. Sometimes it takes a couple people a lot more time. But they eventually get there is because their mindset, their mindset is on a goal. And that goal leads to success. Success is subjective. But a lot of guys, they want to get mad at that. Because their mind is on foolishness. They're delusional. Their mindset is delusional as hell. That's not nobody's fault. But you have to change the mindset if you want results you want to change a lifestyle you want to have a change environment if you want better people to come in your life you have to change your mindset why would the hell they want to hang with you if your mindset low what can they what can they gain from you friends friends supposed to benefit each other so if you just benefiting off that guy and he can't benefit off you then what the fuck why why he need to be your friend it's supposed to go both ways Pharaoh you have to change that mindset, bro. A lot of you guys, you, you you be motivated a little bit and you feel like you want to change your mindset and then you just go right back to the habit because it's so addicting. It, it, that, that's something that you're so used to, you was so comfortable with. But you have to break that chain. You have to break that pattern in your life and start changing it your, uh, uh, to a different pattern. Start changing your lifestyle. Start thinking better. Start making better decisions. Start changing to abundance mindset. But the only way you can become the person who you want to become, if you want to get out of the situation you're in right now, you don't want to be behind. You don't want to be stuck in life, but you you have to change that mindset. You have to. That's that's important, guys. Like mindset is first. If you don't got that in order. Everything else will fall. That I had to develop my mindset into, I had to change my mindset in, in order to do YouTube. I had to. If I had the same mindset before I did YouTube, I wouldn't be doing YouTube. I had to change my mindset into doing YouTube and being consistent and doing videos, actually moving forward with my life. If you can't never change your mindset, you always gonna be fat. You gonna always think about the food that you wanna eat. You always gonna think about eating cakes and honey buns and eating high calorie ass shit. But if you change your mindset, bro, like, bro, if I, like, I need to lose weight right now. I need to start drinking a gallon of water every day. I need to hit that cardio. I need to at least run a mile or at least run 30 minutes or 20 minutes. You know, start changing your mindset into, okay, this is what I need to do to elevate in my life. This is what I need to do to become better for myself. But in order to do that, you have to change your mindset. If you don't, then you always go run back into the same situation that you're in now. You go always be that loser. You go always be that person that ain't going to get nowhere in life. And watching everybody else win. But in order to move on, in order to take step by step, you have to develop some sort of type of mindset with yourself. But you have to break that chain. You have to really want it for yourself. You have to. And it takes time to change into a, a mindset. To change it into a different uh, a monster takes time to do that. It takes time to uh, figure out what you want to be in life and having goals 
and setting setting standards for yourself. It takes time. It don't just happen overnight. It takes time. Some of the times it takes you guys a week. You know, if you were a really fast person to make, you know, some decisions that actually really want to get better, then it takes you a little faster. Some of you guys, it may take a month. Sometimes it takes you five months, a year. But you have to get the same thing that you got used to the mindset that you are now. You have to get used to a better mindset when you start changing into a better mindset. You have to start getting used to that instead of the old mindset. Once you change your mindset, you're a whole different person. Some people may look at you how you was back in the back in the day when you had that really weak mindset. And some people may keep judging you because they see you changing. Your mindset is different and they trying to hate on you now because now you starting to realize that it was your mindset the whole time. And now you starting to self-improve and they want to hate on you because of that. But at the end of the day, bro, you can't let that shit bring you down. That's why I, I come and say again, guys, that's when you need to develop an alpha mindset. Have some type of masculine energy with yourself, not letting people get into your emotions. So that way you don't start going back and let the people feed on you on that type of bad behavior or those bad talks to try to convert you back into the old mindset. You need to be like, bro, fuck them, bro. I'm going to move on. I'm going I'm to continue what I need to do. This is best for me. When people start talking, when people start hating, that means you're doing something good for yourself. When people ain't, that means you ain't really no type of competition. You ain't no threat. That's a problem. It shouldn't be quiet. It should be some noises. Either people cheering on for you or even people booing you. Even if you're doing good, people go still boo. But then you still got some people that's going to cheer. People go see, want to see you do great things. Those are the people you need to surround yourself with. Because like I said, when you develop into a better mindset, then you start, you starting to be around the people that, that has the same mindset as you. People that's going to support you and cheer, cheer you on as well. You go get away from the losers because those are the guys that's going to boo on you. Because they, they see you changing. They see you being the odd person out at the end of the day. And they don't like that. Which is understandable. Because some people, they just don't want to change. They try to live under their excuses. They try to live under their complaints. Being stubborn and shit like that. And they feel like somebody need to come save them. Which is fucking false. Leave them on the fucking back burn And move to something better. But in order for you to start changing everything around you, you need to change your mindset. You getting tired of having a junky ass room. You need to start thinking like, bro, I need to clean this room so I can be more organized. So I can come home and just lay on my bed. It feels better. I need to clean my car because there ain't no reason why I can't even get in the back seat. All of that's going to start develop some sort of type of mindset. Small things can develop mindset too. Brushing your teeth two days a week. Drinking water every day. You know what I'm saying? At least give me a gallon. You know, or uh, or, or or one liter of uh, type of water. You know, start taking care of your skincare routine. Once you start taking care of yourself, then you start developing some type of mindset. You start to develop, develop some type of habit with yourself into becoming better and self-improving yourself. Small things like that can get you up to the big things. And once you start realizing that the small things, you, you got control of the small things, then you can start aiming for the big things. Okay, maybe I need to start a business. Maybe I need to move up for my move up in my job. Maybe I'm ready to be a leader. Things like that is going to prepare you for better opportunities, but you got to start for the small things. It's gonna be it's gonna be slow for you. Slow motion is better than no motion. You know what I'm saying? But once you change that mindset, bro, that's when you're going to start seeing results. That's when you're going to start living a better life. That's when you're going to have the lifestyle that you always want. Because when you have a mindset that is low, then you're going to do low shit. But if you have a mindset with high standards, then you're going to, do, you're going to achieve high standard shit. It's simple, guys. It's not hard. It's not fucking hard. I hope you guys like this video, man. Share this video with anybody that you need to hear this. Give me a thumbs up, man. Some